Carmel Fury FC closed out their three-game homestand Friday night at TD Place, extending their unbeaten streak to three games with a 2-2 draw against FC Edmonton in another chapter of the Canadian Derby that saw Tommy Stewart score the fastest goal in Fury FC history while Maxime Tissot scored for the first time in Fury Colours. Here's how it came together at TD Place. Okay, oh, it's okay. a giveaway, and it's a 1-0 Ottawa Fury FC lead. It was a terrible giveaway, and Stewart had to put it nowhere but the back of the net in the second minute. And just like that, it's 1-0 Ottawa. Here's Timbo in for Stewart. Push down, and penalty. Here we go, Ryan Williams from the spot, steps up. And it stopped. Oh, encroachment. By whom? I think, it, I think it's encroachment against FC Edmonton, and Ottawa's gonna get another opportunity. Marquez blows his whistle. Williams steps up, and he stopped again. A great penalty save from Matt Van Ockel in the Amway Canadian Championship against FC Edmonton. And here come the Eddies trying to counter. Shot on goal. And, oh, a couple of saves from Pazier. Third effort, and it's knocked off the line by Timbo. It's taken short, comes to Oliveira on the left. Now he delivers, headed towards goal, and ooh, Eddie Edward with a great opportunity there. Fury work it. Forward. Here's a chance for Tiso. Maxim Tiso in the 36th minute. And Ottawa Fury FC have that two goal lead. Wow. Good for the Fury. I believe that first shot came from Stewart and it was blocked by Van Ockel from point blank range. But Tiso came roaring into the penalty box and smacked it into the back of the net. Nyasi delivers. Right footed in swinger. Headed towards goal. And it's 2 1. Just like that. A set piece goal for the Eddies. Now, a chance for the Eddies, and oh, it's 2 2, just like that. Slipping in behind the defense and scoring in the 62nd minute. It looks like Daryl Fordyce I again. I think it is. Flicked on on the left side towards Eckersley. It deflects off him right to Amiobi. Amiobi, now Eckersley a shot, and it's played off the line by Rafael Alves in the 93rd minute. A game saver there from Alves, but Eckersley again with a cross, headed away. And played towards goal, and it goes off the bar. Man, what wow. opportunities for FC Edmonton to win it at the death, but there goes the final whistle. Ottawa will now embark on a 13-day road trip that will see the club travel over 8,600 kilometers starting Wednesday in Puerto Rico. Fury FC return home on September 24th when they take on Minnesota United FC. Tickets available at ottawafuryfc.com.